The Empire State Building was a major tourist attraction in New York City. The thing to do, throw ballpoint pens off the roof. Suddenly, bodies began to pile up under the building. Why? For an experiment, we got special permission to drop a pen off the Empire State Building and measure how long it took for the pen to completely fall to the ground. It was nine seconds. Since we know that the initial velocity is zero meters per second, if we figure out the final velocity of the pen, we can solve for the average velocity and find out the height of the Empire State Building. So, how do we solve for the final velocity? By using the equation, the change in velocity is equal to acceleration times time. The acceleration is equal to the pull of gravity, which is negative 9.81 meters per second squared, and the time is 9 seconds. Once multiplied, it equals about negative 88 meters per second. That is the final velocity. Now, we can solve for the average velocity, which is half the initial velocity plus the final velocity. The average velocity can be solved by 0 minus 88 over 2, which is about negative 44 meters per second. Since the change in distance is the average velocity times the time, we can find out the height of the Empire State Building by multiplying negative 44 meters per second and 9 seconds, which equals negative 396 meters. So, that is the change in distance from the Empire State Building Observatory to the ground. Now, we can answer the question as to why so many people died. Because the pen traveled at negative 88 meters per second, which is about 200 miles per hour, and the shape of the pen hurtled towards the ground like a missile, it penetrated people's skulls.